Right, two-stroke technology, why a Formula One even looking at it? This is a typical setup where the air-fuel mixture is allowed to circulate inside the crankcase unusually. Because it's in the crankcase, we now need to add two-stroke oil into the fuel to be able to lubricate things like the bearings and the crankshaft itself. Now that mixture moves up through a transfer port as the piston comes down, it opens this port and allows that mixture into the combustion chamber. But because we've now got oil inside the fuel, we get that horrible, nasty blue smoke coming out the exhaust pipe when the piston moves down and opens that port. That's one bad thing. The other is that because there's an overlap between the inlet port opening and the exhaust port closing, some of that unburnt fuel goes straight out the exhaust, utterly inefficient. So why on earth are Formula One interested? Well, they're not interested in that. They're interested in stuff like this, the opposed piston engine. Still a two-stroke, still uses ports to allow air inside the combustion chamber, exhaust ports to let it out again, but the combustion chamber is now in between two opposed pistons working towards each other. You notice only air is now coming in through this port because the fuel is now directly injected into that combustion chamber directly injected and utterly efficiently controlled through electronics along with the sparks to make the whole thing more efficient. That's one thing. The other is that all of the work being done by that explosion, the release of energy, is working now in two fronts on both pistons, both of them working on two crankshafts getting more work from that fuel. Over on this side, when the explosion happens, it pushes down on one side on the piston, but on the other side, a lot of that heat energy is wasted through the cylinder head. No cylinder head here, far more efficient system. Imagine that, perhaps in a V formation, supercharged or turbocharged, alongside some kind of hybrid technology with an ecological fuel as well. You can imagine an efficient, highly productive, powerful, fast, high revving, small and lightweight engine. That is why Formula One are interested.